Moses signed the a call before us. Moses went back to the mountain. The brother Moses could do before us. And when Moses got to the mountain, Okuhu said, "Yam kupa umwe fuye pa." He realized that God was so furious. Yam umwe fu Israel fuye papa. God was angry with the Israelites. After saving you from Egypt, crossing the sea with you, giving you a miraculous water to drink, after feeding you with manna, all that you could do is to remove all the jewelries and golden ornaments that you have to create a god. And the man of Moody, you know, the Albertini, I had to say, Would you go to know where we're good in your Abayo Honey Assum? After I saved you from Israel, after I've given you water to drink, and after I've caused the manna to come down just so you could be fed, and after I brought you out of your problem, all that you could do was to have an image of, an, of a little God just to worship it. Bumia nimtia, gume ni muasi. Wanda ni wechiri chile mi ya bosho bosho media. Me buwe fu me kumu njina da saya the Lord. If you belittled me and disrespected me so much and worship just an image, then I'm going to kill you. I am your God. Ana Moses called on Koto Jenny. Then Moses went down on his knees. Moses wept and pleaded and pleaded and pleaded before God to forgive the Israelites. Moses who called God to judge him, O suye panya me chau se fa che woma. Moses went down on his knees to plead and to weep so that God will forgive the Israelites. Moses begged them, begged them, begged them, begged and even said, quoted God. Se onyango pa. So who come Israel for ya? Pharaoh ni nendo mi nina abaka se. Who nyabi ya wusi wudo wumano? So called loving God, no. You saved your people and you killed all of them. And ya nyame na dia wuye ya nomfaso abe na wohu. So Moses pleaded and went on to plead and to plead to the extent that he even quoted and said, if you could bring them this far from from allowing Pharaoh to kill them or from preventing Pharaoh to kill them only to bring them this far to kill them yourself then Pharaoh is going to say this is what you did you just brought them out so that you could kill them and it means that what you did for them will mean nothing and in Jonah coupon kind sir and so God said Moses in the awakening in no matter Moses in the awakening in our who ain't you know made a warm bonnet at all Moses I've heard all that you have said and I've heard all that you have you have and I've also seen all that you are saying and so I'm going to forgive them their sins that was the first time that I saw human being advising God and that was the very first time I mean who said now coupon nipa air can I say my actually I'm coupon my nazi I say Sabre de ne mre di kenya mi hu se onyankopon etie enimpa afutu. And that was the very first time I realized that God had listened to the advice from a mere human being. Te yankopon se me de achewo. And so God said he had forgiven. Na even on the achewo no kura no. Bible say e fo mu paaye. E ma e mere ma 36000. Yankan kola Young Kai Emma, and it's a memory at 36,000. Yeah, 36,000 times two of women. Even when he said he had forgiven them, the earth opened its mouth to swallow 36,000 men. Women were not counted, and children were also not counted. And so, if we want to consider times two of the men who went down the earth, then how many people went down actually? And 72,000 women also followed. And I also want you to know that 72,000 women also followed. And 
72 times 2 will be how much? And how, what will be the result of 72 times 2? 144 children. 144,000 children also followed. Then it means that 144,000 children also followed. And then to the calculate it, 36,000, 72,000, 144,000. And so I want you to do the calculation for 36,000, 72,000, and 144,000 children. Children. What can you do more? Over 200 to 300,000 people of the Israelite, the people that he cherished and loved so much, went down. Yes, I will count on you in Abuma. You've been a nipper, a bro, bear, 200, a cot, 3,000, and a one nipper share as a sinner, and now swimming in a nipper, not young coupon, a dom. And no crown, let us say, Moses, a catch that is a up at the chow. Let's not forget that Moses had pleaded on their behalf and that he had forgiven. Nobody is teaching you the wrath of God. Nobody is teaching you the bad side of God. Nobody is teaching you the wicked side of God. Nobody stops him. Nobody teaches you about the wrath of God. Nobody teaches you about the wicked side of God. Nobody does that. All the time, all that we get to know is that Jesus is good. I don't know. And the member what the second face of God, you people don't know. But maybe another story. Then, my beloved, I want us to know that we do not know the second personality or side of God. I just want to share a story. There is a man called Akan, or better, maybe a name from Akan. There was a man named Akan. Now, Akan we know was Israel for him. And Akan was among the Israelites. That Yamika said. The very day Jesus said they should pack up and cross the river Jordan. I can echo baby a your tent. I saw you fear you see my young couple on. I can call her. I can went to the place where there was a tent put up to worship God. Now bring a yee yee tent. No cranes are never so if you had a big eye. A big go. After the tent was dismantled, the coins that had been collected in the church, some was left behind. Now I can FS our coins and all ADCA. And I can took those coins and hid them. Now bro will try Jordan. After they had crossed Jordan. Now I was say the Israelites, the people that God loved so much. Then the Israelites, which is the people that God loved so much. I was so omni crobia ya from I a kuntoka. The Israelites had to go to war with the people of I. I is just a uh, uh, 240 square uh, meters land. I will say it's just a 240 meters land. Yes, just a uh, do even uh, what they can put. That means the land is not even up to an acre. In the power what is what to be a conquer Israel for our year thousands. The people who dwelled in the land could conquer the people of Israel, Israelites who were over thousands. But because God was angry with them because of what the what Akan did, the Akan yeah, you know, it no nyanku pombwe for because of what Akan did, that is the collection of the coins. God was furious with Akai. And into the Omama, I for Kunkumi Israel for the more soldiers I a smile. I for Kunkumi Onina. He allowed the people of I to kill the Israelites, even though the Israelites were in their numbers and had most soldiers with them. Now, Joshua called Jabi and said, Jabi, why are we being defeated by I? And they did the I crook it to get it. A member of Womukra will do hundred. Won't come here in Israel for Madame McIntyre Cow for. And Joshua went to God and asked why they were being defeated by a small land which contained just 
a few people and these people were not even to match the Israelites yet they were killing them the akoba ye na ne se na sorry fisika eni se obi de nsa ka no ai wa febi akan afebi e de esie what happened was that jesus told joshua that because akan had stolen from his church or from what belonged to him god that is why he had decided or allowed the eye to kill them and into the ekosi ye no se yakopon share joshua se onkum akan and then I see for Neire Ebusienina, or Nosun Ebusienina, all the descendants and the generation of Akan and the family of Akan were buried alive. And Nuntin Yankuponche, Joshua said, Uncle Nuncum Akan Ebusian for anyone I was saying, I see you now. Neire and the man and Crawfunina. God ordered that Joshua killed every one of them. If God is that merciful. If God is that good all the time, and they into the one spare account. If God really is good all the time, as we say, then why didn't He spare the life of Akan? Mama, pastor, what you say? I say, say you who say God is merciful. God is merciful. Onyango pon your door. Onyami ya mabrohufu. Onyami your door. Onyami ya mabrohufu. You will never believe in hell. I want you to understand that if all that we we'll consider and know is the fact that Jesus is good all the time, then we will not even believe in the story of hell and heaven. God has his second side. I want you to understand that God has a second personality or side of him. And that the second personality or side of God has that wicked personality that we have never encountered before. The furious side, nyamie bufo, nyamie netri mo ding, nyamie saya o saya dia no. Un tumi mfe un compare abrunza. The wicked and the furious side of Jesus Christ or God cannot be compared to that of Satan, who we even consider to be the most wicked person. Osumafo Morrison. This is Messenger Morrison. Obetimia was up in 0247701364. You can WhatsApp or call on 0247701364. Now me bamawe who on yang kupon send the bufu nani trimu netinum or dim rini riedua and niama yoye. And I'll make you understand the things that God can do when he's really angry or when his his wrath is upon you. Na me ma wati asiye se. O nyame ebufu shie e ba asasi e ni nimpe yina aso e renche. I want you to understand that God is ver very angry and that his anger is going to be upon every person on this earth very soon. Me ba chira o se nye nyanko pon si se yi nimpa wabira nimpe wui. Oma nimpa do mwa wabira nimpe wui. Me ba chira o se nye nyanko pon tu me man nimpa da ne ya abuwa. Se wong kain ne buka dine is da story ya. I'm going to let you know or to teach you to understand how God can be so furious and angry with you such that he can turn you into an animal even when you are alive just like that of the story of Nebuchadnezzar and that he can make you rot while you are still alive. God bless you so much. Ark on the way to heaven. And this is Ark. We are on the way to heaven. God bless you this. Osuma for Morrison. Onya min shura weye Osuma for Morrison. Obe ti mi ako Facebook, YouTube. Obe ti mi ako all the social media. Na wako seche Osuma for Morrison. And that's the Ark of Salvation Ministry International. Visit our YouTube page, our YouTube channel, and then our Facebook page, and all the social media platforms you know, and type in Osuma for Morrison or the Ark of Salvation Ministry. And now so say, Obey to me at telegram it. Now I was up on me on zero two four seven seven zero one three six four. Better still, you can also WhatsApp or telegram me on zero two four seven seven zero one three six four. God bless you. Onyamishrao.